What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. If you're here for the first time, thank you so much for watching. In today's video, as you already know by the title and you clicked on it, it's because we're going to be talking about the new... Well, it's not new, but I guess it's been super like hyped on social media. Um, the Marc Jacobs The Tote Bag. So I kind of wanted something that it was going to be great for spring, summer. It wasn't going to be a lot of money as a Louis Vuitton bag. Um, and then I was looking through Instagram and it comes the Marc Jacobs The Tote Bag. And I was like, she is really pretty. Marc Jacobs The Tote Bag. So really quickly, um, this color, this canvas, this size, was actually not available online. I mean, in stores, you can, um, it's very, very rare that uh, Neiman Marcus carries this one. Um, and then obviously where I live, there's no Nordstrom, so I couldn't pick it up. So I went ahead and ordered it directly from the Marc Jacobs website. So this is the tote bag. I got this mini, the mini size in the cream uh, beige canva with the black um, strap which I thought the color combination was great because I'm either wearing black or I'm either wearing a light color. So for me, it was just like a great. Now I was debating whether I get the mini or the smaller size. Um, and obviously when you are buying it online, you are taking the risk of dimension. So I just went for it. I was like, I think in the, the girl in the... Oh, I can't speak today. The girl in the the mannequin or the model in the website, she had it on and I was like, okay, it looks like a small bag, which is what I am looking for, especially for my everyday bags. So, um, it is a very nice camba field. Um, it's not heavy at all, which I was a little afraid. Um, some purses, when you get it right off the bag, the bag is heavy per se. So let's first start off with, I already said the color, then um, price point on this one, I think this one goes for $275. Um, that's where they start. They, they go all the way up to, I think, four something, which is the bigger, the medium size in leather. I so wanted that one, but the color... I so wanted the leather one, but the color that I wanted was completely sold out and somebody was selling it on a website and she was selling it for 600 and something. So she was doubling the price and I was like, no, I was like, I passed. So I decided to go for this one just because I wanted something smaller, more, com more compact, more everyday. I can take to the pool. I can take to the beach. So I kind of wanted a tote bag that was for an everyday so after that, I was like, I'm done. Um, I absolutely love the uh, black uh, black and white. It's actually white, yeah, because it's lighter than the purse. Um, strap, which is completely adjustable, which is great. Um, and it's so cool because you can wear her like this in your arm. So I'm going to kind of stand back and show you really quick how it wears. So you can either wear her like this in your arm, which it looks super, super pretty. I've worn it like this, but I feel like there's the reason why there is a strap is so that you can obviously put it as a cross body. And this is what it looks like. I, I don't think I can go further back. So this is pretty much what she looks like. I am a very petite person, very small, very on the thin side. So she kind of looks bigger on me than it looked on the model, but I love that um, it has a perfect size for an everyday bag. And also it's not ridiculously big to the point where, so it's not ridiculously big to the point where I'm just going to um, stuff it with a lot of things. That was another thing where I was looking for something that I wouldn't fit a lot of things in the purse. Um, so in the inside of the purse, it's just one entire, um, as you can see, it's just one in entire compartment. There's no division. There is on um, this one. There is no little zippers where you can kind of like put away something. So it's completely open, just one compartment. That is it. Um, oh my God, I still have the little, the little cover thingy on, on here. Look, guys, I'm so crazy. I'm taking this off. Anyways, <laughs> I'm gonna leave it like that. So actually, I don't mind the fact that it has one compartment inside. I feel like I'm able to, um, 
stuff things in here and it fits a great amount of things you guys normally i like to use like little bags um inside my bags where everything is kind of like divided and it fits a pretty much a a few amount of things to be honest no this size does not fit a laptop or an ipad um it will probably fit an ipad mini um but not a regular ipad air or an ipad pro um i just think it's a great purchase for someone trying to get into a brand name um purses or you're trying to buy something brand name but you don't want to spend over a thousand dollars on a purse you can start here it is super pretty it is beautiful you can dress her you can dress her up dress her down and i'm super 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 excited i feel like it is a must-have for spring or summer you can either do the mini or you can size up to the small to the medium or even to the larger tote bag so for me like i said i wanted something small something that i can use on an everyday basis when i'm wearing like sneakers or whatever and I'm excited I got her. Um, I love that she's really sturdy. So if I sit her here, she stands by herself. And that's something that I love when it comes to bags. I love that my bags are not slouchy. My Louis Vuitton is not slouchy depending on what I put on her. Um, but my bags, I hate it when they slouch. Like, I really cannot stand it. So this one is really, really nice. The fact that it's super sturdy. Um, it is, it feels super, like, good, heavy sort of weight on it. Like, I don't know how to explain it. Like, it feels like it's a good bag. I feel like you spe you get what you actually spend on this bag. Hold on, my husband's brewing coffee. So I feel like I bought good quality for the price um it doesn't feel cheap it doesn't feel like crap i paid over 200 dollars for this purse and honestly like it just feels like like literally any purse and it's not like worth it or whatever i feel like it's 100 worth it i'm super super excited um i will try to pop some pictures here of the outfits i've worn her with but i'm telling you like she's a nun stop wearing her for spring and summer and i think for summer i think i'm gonna size up a little bit just for beach purposes or pool purposes because obviously here i won't i can't fit a lot but if you're looking for like a small everyday bag on the high end on the name brand designer brand and you don't want to break the bank i say you should go for the tote bag they do come in different um shades so you have with this one you either have the black one with the letters in white or you have the cream one with the letters in black. As you go leather, you'll have like that nice dusty pink, that brown. You have it in black. Um, and you have um, pretty much of other options when it comes to it. But I thought this color was going to match with everything. Is it worth it? 100%. Is, I think it's a perfect price point for her. And I absolutely love this bag. And I'm so happy I found her. And I got my hands on it. So... If I were you, I wouldn't waste no time because they. I've been seeing a lot of people wear it when I go out and I just think she's really, really pretty. So I don't want to make this video any more extent. Um, I just kind of want to give you my thoughts, my opinion, and kind of give you a little bit of um, information on the bag, um, my thoughts on it and what it looks like. And if you are debating whether to get it or not, I hope that this video was somewhat... Oh, wow. Oh, jeez. I have my own barista, you guys. Oh, so pretty. Oh, you brought me sugar. He's a keeper. Anyway, so I really hope that um, I was able to kind of influence in the purchase of this bag because you will not, you will not be disappointed. I'm sorry, guys. I just need to, I just need my afternoon coffee first. Mm. Yum. <laughs> I hope you... I already said that. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for sticking to the end. If you liked the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Let me know if you have this bag down below. Let me know if you have it in any other size. Let me know your thoughts on it. Tell me, Francis, I love it. I don't like it. Just let me know on the comment section down below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.